you're going to think I'm a little kooky. I'm going to do sprints, Charleston sprints with the new 2018 American Mahjong card. I haven't been able to play yet, but I want to see if I can make decisions in under three minutes. Normally I do under two minutes for an advanced player, but I think with the new card, you should give yourself a little bit of grace. Tack on a minute to what you're usually targeting just till you get used to the card because it takes a while when you get down to the hand level to figure out what you're going to do. There are a lot of new combinations on there and two additional hands. Let's see what happens. If you're new to Mahjong or if you already know how to play and just want to build your skills, consider subscribing to my channel. Click the bell when you do so you don't miss anything. Let's do some sprints. Let's say we're the dealer. I'll get 14 tiles. And make a mock Charleston. Okay, I see ones and one, two, three, four, five wins and dragons. We can't keep it all. Let's pass these three. East and west. East and west. We could play that pair hand. Ooh, three. One. Okay, let's pass one dragon. Maybe we could play the news pair hand. News with three consecutive numbers. Let's pass those three. Oh my gosh, look at that. We gotta pass it. Exchange. Oh my goodness sake. Okay, I am not gonna pass that. News one, two, three, or three, four, five. Let's give up the one, two. Let's give up a one, two, nine. Oh, pass. Oh, you know what? We could make that a little better. There. Four. And we have tiles we can pass. Two, two, three, four. Okay, now I would only pass two, one blind. Oh. Look, we got the West back. Four discards for a pair hand, really five, two, three, four, or three, four, five with news. First, single and pair hand. That was not bad. And I went nine seconds over. That's staying at the category level. Not too bad. Let's do another one. If you would have done something different for sprint one, write that in the comment section. I think a two, four, six, eight hand, two, four, six, eight. Don't have to pick a hand till we run out of discards. Let's pass these three. Two, four, six, eight. There's a four. We don't have to pick a hand till we run out of discards. Let's pass these three. Actually, let's pass these three. East and West with odds this year again. Oh, two and a two. We got two tiles to pass. I think this two dot is kind of an outlier. Let's discard these three. Eight, same thing. Let's exchange the joker. One, three, eight, we can pass those three. 
six, same thing. But here's a six now, two, four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight, six south. Let's look real quick. Two, four, six, eight, pair hand. Two, four, six, eight, pair hand, second one down. Either that or there are two, two, four, six, eight, one suit options. Let's pass those three. Discards. Let's pass those three. Let's pass those three. Lap. Okay, Joker bait. Maybe don't need it though, because we're playing a pair hand. I would play a pair hand. I think this would be the second one down under singles and pairs. Two flowers. Then we have pairs of two, four, six, eight, and then pairs of two like even numbers. As an option, we can hold the joker for potentially the first two, four, six, eight hand, or we could even play the fourth one down. There's three actually under under two, four, six, eight that we could play as an option if the if the pair hand doesn't come in. I would hold these for joker bait and discard those. If you would have done something different here, write it in the comment section. And let's go on to sprint three. Okay, ones, this is the strength, really, one, but we do have some four, six, eight again. Six, eight, four, six, eight, right here. Four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight. We could play a year hand, maybe. Let's discard these three. Two. We have tiles we can pass. Don't have to pick a hand till you run out of discards. Okay, we have tiles we can pass here. Four, six. Okay, four, six, north, south. Now we have to pick a hand. Okay, I think the ones can go. Two, four, six, four, six, two, four, six, eight. I think I'd rather pass up the ones than pass two wins. Exchange any jokers. There's five. We don't need a five. We can use maybe the six. Let's pass these three. Two and four. Two, four, six, eight. Okay, we have two tiles to pass, including a white dragon. Now, let's see, I think we can give up the six crack. There is a pair hand, two, four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight. Let's pass these three. There's an eight, we just gave it up. Two, four, let's see, four, six, two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight. Let's see. Two, four, six, eight. Two, four, six, eight. Dragon. Two, four, six, eight, eight. Two, four, six, oh, eight, eight. I think I would just pass one. And if anyone wanted one, I'd say no thank you. Lap it. Okay. Two, four, six, eight. I would not make a decision here. I would just get rid of the this and see what happens. We have no flowers. There's only one hand under two, four, six, eight with flowers, so that's not a problem. There are one, two, three with mixed suits, 
So those are all options. We have the wrong suit for the white dragons. I think these are going to be joker bait. There is one, two, four, six, eight pair hand. And we do have two, four, six, eight with opposite eights. Two, four, six, eight with opposite eights. But we'd have to throw away two pair. I don't think I would want to do that. I think what I would do, if I had to pick a hand, I would probably play two, four, six, eight, the second one from the bottom, where it's two, two, four, six, eight, and then we would have joker bait. But I would not actually do that. I would wait. I would keep all my two, four, six, eight, hold them, get rid of these, and then whittle down as I pick and discard. If you would have done something different with this, write sprint three and what you would have done. Let's see what the timing is here. Okay. Sprint one, two minutes, nine seconds. Sprint two, two minutes, eight seconds. Sprint three, two minutes and 46 seconds. Okay. So that's one almost a minute over for three sprints. So that's not too bad, I don't think, for it being a new card. And I, so yeah, I think give yourself an, an extra minute until you're used to the card, maybe a month after playing for a month or something like that. And then try to whittle down two minutes for advanced, three minutes for intermediate, four minutes for a beginner. So for, for maybe the first month that you play with the new card, give yourself an extra minute. If you're playing in a tournament, especially early on when you're just getting the card, this is a really great way to practice because you're still on that timer. I don't think they're going to give you any more time. It's probably still going to be a 12 minute game. If you have a set at home, give this exercise a try and let me know how it goes for you. If you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, consider subscribing and then click the bell when you do. That way you get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss any opportunities to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight of the game that might give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next Charleston Sprints for American Style, may all your picks be keepers.